What's up everyone, my name is Alex Costa and man, it's funny, like the way that guys and girls think is so different. You know, we really do think differently. That's why a lot of guys have a hard time figuring out what girls actually want, right? The truth is, most of the time, they won't say anything. Just, they just expect you to know, which is kind of messed up. But don't worry, in today's video, my goal is to show you exactly what girls want from you. But they will never admit this. But don't worry, in today's video, my goal is to show you exactly what girls want from you, but will never admit. And if you're new to the channel, hi, my name is Alex, and it is my job to teach you everything I know about dating, men's fashion, men's hair, fitness, and so much more. If that sounds good to you, then hit that subscribe button below and join the family of over three million subscribers. All right, the first thing that girls want from you is they want you to take initiative from the very beginning. As a guy, it's important to read these signals that girls send you, right? And a lot of times they're very easy to miss. Like, for example, you're at a party, you're at a bar, and a girl looks at you and you're pretty sure that she looked looked. You know, like she really did. What do you do? Well, my friends, the thing is, you're not gonna find out unless you go over there and ask. Maybe she thought she recognized you from somewhere and there's nothing there. Or maybe she thought you were a cool, attractive dude. Either way, take initiative and go over there and show her that you're the real deal. You're not gonna sit around and wait for anything in your life. You go after what you want in life. And that extends through a relationship as well. You know, if you've, you've been seeing this girl for a while, but you, you take initiative to book a table at her favorite restaurant. You take initiative to solve any problems in your relationship. She's gonna love that because again, it shows that you get things done. You don't wait around. Next, girls definitely love compliments about their looks, their voice, their work. Anything that you truly believe deserves an honest compliment, don't hold it back, you know? But no girl is ever gonna say, hey, I really like compliments. Can you just like let me know when I look good? That is weird. It's a little creepy. So just do it naturally. Side note here, I will say don't do it all the time. Don't overdo it because it diminishes the value of the compliment and it makes it seem like you're just saying anything that will get her to smile. So drop these compliments once in a while when you truly believe in what you're saying and I'm telling you, she will smile ear to ear. All right, you know what else women want but will never really admit it? They want you to be good in bed. They want you to know what you're doing. And yes, it's an awkward subject, but that's why we have this channel, to talk about these things here openly because how else are you supposed to know? Right, guys need to learn this somewhere because women expect them to be good at it. But guys, one of the biggest, if not the biggest problem when it comes to being good in bed is erectile dysfunction or ED. For you guys that don't know that term, it's basically the inability to keep an erection for intercourse. And yes, us guys, like we don't really like to talk about this, right? A lot of men think it's an embarrassing subject. This is something that affects a lot of men, even a lot of younger men too. Well, today's sponsor is Roman and they've been helping men with ED for years. With Roman, you get a free online evaluation and ongoing care for ED, all from the comfort and most importantly, the privacy of your own home. So this is how it works. They will get a healthcare professional to work with you and find the best treatment. And if medication is suggested, then Roman will ship it to you with free two day shipping. And if you're looking to last longer in bed, which is also, you know, another problem that men have. They also have Roman swipes, which are easy to use, no prescriptions required. We all know that Valentine's Day is approaching quickly, so this can really help you nail your performance. ED or not being able to last in bed can cause stress, you know, relationship strain, and most importantly, it can cause low self-confidence, which is something that you should never ever have to worry about. I want you guys to be confident, to be strong, to not have to worry about these things and just enjoy what you have going on with your partner. So if you wanna check this out discreetly, I'm gonna leave a link below. It's the first link in the description of this video. And you can use that link below to get $35 off your first month of the treatment, plus some free goodies as well with every Roman Swipes purchase. And if you wanna get this by Valentine's Day, just make sure that you order by February 10th to guarantee delivery by V-Day, all right? It's getroman.com slash Alex. All right, since we're on that topic, you know, another thing that women want is foreplay. Just can't go straight into it, man. Like warm it up, you know, getting the vibe going before you go crazy. I'm telling you, this is a real story. This is a, it's a weird one, but true. I've had friends, female friends, complain about their partners on this subject. To me, very awkward conversation, but also valid point 
So make sure that you're not rushing things. You shouldn't just jump from step one all the way to step 10. You need to take it step by step. I know you wanna get the deed done, but foreplay is something that most women truly enjoy and expect from their partners. They like the anticipation, they like the curiosity, the butterflies they get right here. She wants these things. So, you know, start slow, take some time to get her excited and not too nervous, then, Go ahead and do the thing. What else do women want? Well, they also want security. It is one of the biggest things that girls look for in a relationship. Security, whether it's financial or physical, but most likely both. No, I'm not saying every girl wants your money, all right? I'm saying there is a sense of safety that comes from a partner that has a steady job, that has a steady income, right? Someone who has their shit together. No one wants to be with a person who struggles to keep a job because that shows that that person doesn't have the discipline it takes to live a good life. Not only financially, but physically as well, right? They wanna be with a person who protects her from other guys making her feel uncomfortable or from any harm that comes her way. And when I say this, I get a lot of comments from guys thinking that I'm telling them to beat up, right? Any other dude who hits on his girlfriend, that is not what I'm saying. She's gonna get hit on regardless, right? She has to know how to dodge those things. That's on her. You just have to make her feel safe when she's with you. The truth is guys, when it comes to a relationship, you need to have each other's back. That is how a relationship works. The next thing that girls definitely want, but they won't really admit it, is they don't want you to follow, but especially not like other girls' photos and accounts. I know it's 21, 2021. Can I say just 21 now? Is that a thing? I'm making it a thing. I know it's 21. I feel like it's like 1921. <laughs> but I, you know what I mean? Like. There's, there's a lot of girls on Instagram, there's a lot of girls on social media and they're good looking, but you cannot be doing that if you're in a relationship. It's going to give her weird mixed emotions that is not what we want. That's not gonna get you anywhere, you know, except into an argument. It's definitely gonna get you into an argument. If you're liking every single bikini photo that you see on Instagram, go on Explore page, there's a lot of them. It's not gonna go well for you. It's a little creepy as well. It can be weird. So supporting your friends on social media, if you have, you know, girls, that are your friends, that is completely fine. But flirting, leaving heart eye emojis and liking every single bikini photo, if you have a girlfriend, is not a vibe. And if you don't have a girlfriend, honestly, it's probably not a vibe either. It can make you look super thirsty. It can make you look desperate. So, you know, don't be liking every single photo. My advice is be a little bit stingy when it comes to liking girls' photos, especially if it's like a sexy photo. And if you're in a relationship, definitely stay away from it. Because they won't admit it, but they don't want it. They will admit it if you're in an argument. They'll bring that right up and damn, you are in trouble then, my man. Guys, don't forget to check out Roman and order yours before February 10th to get it in time before Valentine's Day. The link is in the description below for more fashion and lifestyle inspiration. Man, I have been posting a lot. Posting a lot on TikTok, posting a lot of on Instagram, on Reels. So go check it out, guys. It is at Alex Costa. Uh, I'm gonna leave everything listed in the description below. And I just wanted to thank you guys so much. I know it happened probably like two weeks ago, but we hit three million subscribers, man. And that is insane. So if you liked today's video, join the family. We'd love to have you here. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you again very, very soon. Peace.